turn it over to the fans now. Um, we'll go ahead and go with the first question right over there. Oh if your boy. question sucks, Jason's going to come slap you. Make it good. Um, yeah, I uh, had an engagement based on you guys, so it was oh. awesome. Um, oh, nice. Oh, very nice. So, uh, post like meeting, will we see the process of like marriage, kids, and that's the end, like a little snippets, or will we meet and then develop and stops, and we just assume that oh, okay, it ended well. <laughs> Um, I, I, you know, I, and obviously that, that's a good question and we don't want to give anything away because we don't want to tell you what you're going to find out or how you're going to find it out or when you find it out, but I will say that, uh, uh, <laughs> so I tell you that's anything. my answer. No, uh, <laughs> no but, she got engaged to How I Met Your I Mother, Carter. What the hell? <laughs> uh, wait, engaged to How I Met Your Mother? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, one of the... Among the many reasons that we wanted to do a ninth season, and, and a big one again was being able to work with all these people and with this wonderful crew, uh, it, it, the thing, like creatively for Craig and I, the thing that sort of made it really appealing was the idea of, you know, at one point the idea of the show was that the last scene of the last episode is, here's this girl, you know, and, and there was something kind of very kind of poetic and, and cool about that once upon a time. But here we are eight years later and, and, and having had this experience, we, we like you, want to know who this person is. We want to get to know her. We want to see, we want to see, and we want to see Ted happy. We want to see him, you know, see the, the great moments that are, that are ahead of him once he meets this girl. So we will, yeah, you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna see, uh, we're going to get to know this lady and we're going to see the two of them. Yeah, the, the way we ended season eight, we were, were not going to do that until like a couple months before we did it. And it felt so right because ultimately we wanted you, the fans, to meet the mother <laughs> before Ted even gets to meet her. And we're going we're gonna to spend season nine getting to know her and seeing glimpses of her. We can't say exactly how we're going to do it yet, but uh, you'll, you'll, you'll get to know her. Yeah. Thank you. Next question. Um, this question is for... Mr. Siegel? Yes. Um, Thank you for the respect, by the way. I appreciate it. <laughs> Jason, Jason's fine. <laughs> um, I think everyone here knows you also um, as a character on the show. Um, <laughs> his, well, yeah. <laughs> but uh, you're also known on the show as Big Fudge. Yes. <laughs> um, I was wondering, since on the show you are some kind of game master, if you were actually good at games in real life? <laughs> uh, you know, I like a game. <laughs> I like a little game, cat and mouse. <laughs> you know what Jason's really good at is sandwich making. Yes. Yeah, like, I make a great sandwich. good at sandwich making. I and make he a can great make it sandwich. out of like weird things. Yeah. And I it, also enjoy I also enjoy a uh, game of balderdash. <laughs> <laughs> and before we move on, what is the sign for big fudge? Yeah. No. What's the sign? Oh, she's oh, just she's spelling it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Next question? Thank you. Thank Hope you. Hope you fixed your Thank camera. You. <laughs> the Neil Patrick Harris. Step 1. Approach girl. Step two, reveal to her that you are secretly a doctor. Ah! Step three, reveal to her that you have also voiced for Spider-Man on several occasions. Uh-uh! Wow. Step four, take her back to your place to ride the California Screamin'. Yeah! I request the highest of five. You got it! all so much. Oh, boy. Wow. <laughs> well played. Wow. Well played. Well played. Very well, well played. played. That was awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. That was super cool. That was very cool. <laughs> I have to that follow was... that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 
First of all, I have to fangirl for a second because Neil Patrick Harris is up there and he's awesome. Oh, sorry. Um, <laughs> I was wondering if we're gonna have any more Barney Robin dance numbers like we did in the season seven premiere. Well, they do have a first dance. Come on. At the wedding. At the wedding, yeah. I bet it's gonna be epic. Yeah. I think in the and in maybe the... some lifts. <laughs> uh, in last year's finale, we saw the rehearsals for the for the uh, dance yeah. number, and yeah, it'll, it'll uh, there, we know that there's exploding glitter cannons, so <laughs> there's that to look forward to. Next up, all right. Hello. Robin Sparkles. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Robin Sparkles. We have our hanging Chad here too. All right. Oh, nice. Hanging Chad. <laughs> nice. Well played. Every Halloween. There's more hanging chads out there than I ever thought there would be. Who would have thought? <laughs> so I love all of you, um, you, but my question is for Allison. I'm also a huge Buffy fan. Um, <laughs> I was wondering, since Lily has kind of a stealing problem on the show, um, if there's anything you would like to keep from the set after you're done. Good question. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. I, yeah, I should get on that, shouldn't I? <laughs> Actually, we, ha we were sort of looking around last year, weren't we? Because we weren't sure we, get, we were getting a season nine. Um, uh, I really like the little uh, phone booth, the little uh, red, yeah, no, isn't it, wasn't it? It's hard to know because we do so many flashbacks and Ted was living in the apartment, now we're living, it's so confusing. Um, but the little English phone booth that was on the piano, I think? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. The phone booth. I like that. Um, <laughs> That'd be hard to smuggle out of yeah, I've got a lot. Yeah. You don't want the booth? The booth in the bar? Well, where am I going to put that? True. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. intervention banner. That's the a French good horn, the blue French horn. I blue think French Carter horn. and Greg have oh, sticks on that. Thread. Very cool. <laughs> the nude art. <laughs> I burned that mother effer. <laughs> that was humiliating. I know. Our, our sets are so Kendall. amazing. I want to like just steal the entire set because mm. yeah. they are just so cool. Yeah. But where would you put that? I know. Oh. I just want to live there. I like um, Ted's new apartment. It's rad. So good. Thank you. Next question. I'll, I'll find Thanks, something. Guys. Don't worry. Thank Hi guys. You. Hey, hey, there's yes. a blue French horn. Oh, he's got one. Um, I had a question about the music. It seems to be a big theme in the show. Is there anything that you weren't able to include in the show so far um, that mm. you can give us a little sneak peek of? Or is it any musical anecdotes or things you like to sing to each other? What's there a song that you get the rights to? Wasn't there a song oh. that you couldn't get the rights to? Yeah, you could. Neil, Neil was supposed it was, to do, um, <laughs> wasn't he, but, um, but the Rocky, th or something with Rocky? Like, there what were a couple is up, songs that couldn't get the rights to. Were you allowed to do that? Oh, yeah, we that's right. Yeah. Remember that, Neil? No. You were supposed to do, yeah. And they couldn't clear that, right? Yeah, there were a couple things we couldn't get the rights to that were really funny jokes. Jason makes up a lot of great songs. Jace? Jason. Want to sing any of those? <laughs> 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 No. Now's the time. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How about your Jason Segel song? It. What's that? <laughs> the Draco musical? <laughs> it's getting kind of hard to believe things are going to get better. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> uh, you want to know something sad about that? Is uh, Okay, this is true. I didn't write that song for the movie. <laughs> I wrote that song like three years before for a, a, with no sense of irony, <laughs> thinking that I was gonna do a Dracula musical that was gonna like save my dying career. <laughs> <laughs> Guess it kind of did, <laughs> ultimately. 